Hey YouTube fam, it's your girl Gladys, AKA Is That Your Hair, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, tap that subscribe button and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. And if you've been rocking with me for a minute, what's up, what's good, and welcome back. Today's $20 Tuesday. $20 Tuesdays is a special time on my channel where I showcase super cute yet super affordable wigs for the lovely $20 price range and below. So let's just jump right in. I know I've been doing a lot of headband wigs, especially on $20 Tuesday. I have featured a slew of cheap headband wigs. I mean, I have a part one and part two for 10 cheap headband wigs. I have three different videos on Amazon headband wigs and I have two videos where C, my girlfriend, is rating my cheap headband wigs. All of them are in my headband wig playlist, so please check those out. I have a great deal of affordable finds in that playlist. Highly recommend. Check it out after this video. But your girl's taking a little bit of break and coming back to the lace side, the lace fronts, yes. And I am already smiling because I like this. I like this. <laughs> I'm bringing y'all two units today, starting with this one. This is actually a Bobby Boss unit, and the name of this one is Enid, Enid, the MLF 22. And this is from their Truly Me series, which is supposed to be easy, everyday type of wear. I believe a lot of these wigs in this series are under $30, around the $25 price range. And on the stock cards, it says ready wear, natural lace front, hand tied lace part, effortless style, yada, yada, yada. When the Truly Me series first came out, I believe at the end of 2019, I thought I would like it, but then as videos started coming out, I was like, uh, I think this is my least favorite collection from Bobby Was. Honestly and truly, I, I started to feel like that because it was just up and down for me. But when I saw Enid and this wig came out well over a month ago, I was like, let me pick this one up. And I'm so glad I did. She is super, super cute, y'all. Main pros off the bat would have to be this curl pattern. I love this loose wave. It's very easy breezy, perfect vacation hair. And by the time y'all see this premiere party, if you're watching with me, I'm currently in Tulum, Mexico. Hopefully I'm having the time of my life, relaxing, taking a break from YouTube. Maybe, maybe not, I don't know. <laughs> It's really hard for me to stay away from y'all. But yes, I'm away for C's birthday, having a good time. I love this for vacation. Who knows, I may take her with me. I also love the everyday length. This like, what is this, like a good 16, 18 inches? Looks really good on me. And let me just give you a quick 360. So you'll see this is how it looks to the side. Hair to the back. She looks good and I think it's living up to the stock card claims. I do think this is great for everyday wear. She's very easy to put on. I definitely put her on under 10 minutes. And I think if you are a beginner, you'll find her easy to put on as well. Just be mindful that if you are a beginner, one of the most important things to making a wig look natural is just making sure this area is straight. I applied heat to the top because I need that to lay flat. I also use got to be glue gel in the parting space because I want my parting space to lay flat. And I use different powders. I used two different powders this time because I wanted it to blend with my skin. And I think I did a pretty, pretty decent job. This lace front area, you know, I mean, it's not pre-plucked or anything, so I just filled it in. I'm not using that. I filled it in with a Sharpie, but you can use eyeliner, eyeshadow, anything that's black or dark brown. So yeah, y'all, I, I low-key don't want to take this off. She is very becoming on me. <laughs> And I think she goes with the dress I'm wearing today. I'm wearing this fitted dress from Fashion Nova. Hello! <laughs> yes, y'all, she is super cute. And she only retails for about $24. When I first purchased her on wig types well over a month ago, she was 21, but I see the price done went up a little bit. And maybe it's because she's so cute. So yeah, overall, curl pattern, density, length, she's a winner. I am getting some shedding, but I did cut into the lace, so I think that is where it is coming from. If I hadn't have done that, I don't think I would have gotten as much shedding as I did. Another thing I like about Enid or Enid is that she comes with brown lace, which is great for a dark skinned woman like myself. But if you are lighter skin, I don't really think it matters too much because you're gonna end up cutting that lace right off anyway. And if you fill it in like I did, you're not even gonna be using the lace, so. No biggie. But y'all let me know what you feel about this one in the comments down below. Let's jump into the second wig. 
All right, y'all, I'm back with this wig from Outre. This is a new wig from Outre. It's called Outre Arlena, Arlena, and I have her in the 1B. I already put her on my head and flattened on the top with some heat, but I am going to do the hairline area differently. I just wanna show you how I use my CoverGirl foundation to change the lace color here. I have this in the color D90, and I love using this to tint the color of my lace. It depends, you know, if I'm doing a full on frontal, I'll definitely go in with this Ebon Tint Spray first and foremost. But if I'm just using a lace front, I like to use this foundation. So I literally just apply it here and I just blend it in and it normally blends in really, really well. It usually matches perfectly to my skin when I use this. I'm not gonna really go all around the hairline because honestly, y'all, I'm, I'm a little bit of a rush because the sun's going down. But I at least wanted to show y'all how I do it. And this angled brush is the truth. Got this for $1 off of Amazon. One peso. Uno peso off of Amazon, okay? So y'all go ahead and check out that link because I have it linked down below, okay? I am gonna pull this up on my hairline, so. Y'all, don't worry, I'm gonna pull it up like this. It will blend in. See how it's blending in? You see how we do this? Ah, oh, I should have started filming earlier. Why do I do this to myself when I know I wanna get daylight, but I know the sun starts setting earlier and it was raining today? Like, come on, Gladys. You know, you gotta get your ass up earlier next time. Okay, so that's what I do if I want to blend it in. You see how this is blending? Again, I am low-key rushing, so not a huge deal. And then, of course, I go in with my Maybelline Fit Me Powder in the color 360. And you see how the magic happens. Y'all see that? A lot of y'all are new to my channel. Welcome. If you want to see more tips like this, Please check out my wig 101 playlist. I promise you, you will learn something new, especially if you are a beginner to wigs. Because I like to cater to beginners because I know what it feels like to be a beginner in the wig game. And we're just going to stop right here because we are running out of time. So yes, Arlena is pretty. This like body wave right now? Yo, come through. But let me tell you right now, this little $24 number is about to be Tangle City. Oh my goodness. She is pretty as hell, but she is a tangler, okay? So please, uh, please manage your expectations when it comes to these cheaper synthetic wigs because even though I have a lot of affordable wigs that I've found that do not tangle like this, due to the texture of this unit, it is a silkier texture, it's going to tangle. So I know a lot of people like to ask, well, how many wears will I get out of a synthetic wig like this? Not a lot, sis. Probably a few if you're wearing it for like, I don't know, eight hours at a time. Maybe if you wear it for a few events. But don't expect this to last you like an entire month wearing it back to back. Like this is not that type of wig. If that is what you are looking for, I highly suggest you check out my human hair playlist and see if there's something on there that you like that will last longer. I actually have not reviewed a human hair body wave unit yet, but I will soon, so be on the lookout for that. But this is so pretty. Oh my God, but it tangles so much. And it's shedding. This is shedding like crazy. If you are new to synthetic wigs in particular, some of them do shed, especially the cheaper ones. So you just have to be mindful of that. The main thing I love about synthetic wigs is that they already come styled. So the fact that I don't have to spend 30 minutes curling my hair with a curling wand for it to look like this and then hoping it stays in this place with hairspray, I'm cool with that, especially if I'm just buying this for like an event. Again, to me, this is not a wig that I would wear every day due to these tangles alone. Y'all see that? Oh my God, tangling up a lot. <laughs> oh my God, but she's so, I can't even get my fingers through. Yikes, but she is so pretty. So I could already tell when I have a unit like this, this is one of those like, 
almost like a one and done type of unit. I know I said a few wears, but it really just depends on what you're doing when you wear the unit. Like if you are out at a club dancing, probably a lot of us aren't doing that right now because we're in the middle of a pandemic, but if you so happen to find yourself twerking a top somewhere, best believe that this wig may not come back to life the next day. So it all depends, but there are things you can do to lengthen the lifespan of your synthetic wigs. I do have a silicone spray that I recommend linked in my description box through Amazon that helps like make the fibers on, especially on silky wigs like this, that helps it last a little bit longer. But yeah, y'all, she's cute. I wish she was more of a yakier texture because at least I know she wouldn't tangle like the way she's tangling right now. But oh my gosh, do you see me? Oh my God, Arlena, Arlena, Selena, Selena, you are a vibe, mama. You look really good. How do y'all feel about her? I mean, I really love Enid for more of an everyday wear, especially because she's shorter, but Arlena is just so pretty. Oh my goodness. She is gorgeous. Y'all look at this. Come through. And y'all already know I love me some outre, so this is easy. This is actually reminding me of Outre Ashani. I reviewed that half wig in my first 10 cheap headband wig haul. Ashani was so pretty, especially flipped over. This reminds me of Ashani, just this curl pattern. I love, oh, this is one of those wigs, like I, I adore this style. Absolutely adore it. For under $25, I mean, absolutely cannot wait to take pictures in her. Cannot wait. But I'm getting tangles at every freaking corner. <laughs> and of course, a lot of y'all know for $20 Tuesday, the best part is the price. Both of these wigs retail for $24.99, I believe, on wig types or most websites. Get your life. If you find yourself going out somewhere in the next few months, I wouldn't mind picking one of these up, especially if you're like going on a quick little date with your boo, bae, husband, girlfriend, wife, whomever. I would wear this out with C. I think C would actually really love this. Y'all think C would like this? Yeah, I think she would. <laughs> I feel like if she didn't know me, she'd want to take me, take me home. So yes, y'all, please let me know how you feel about these two wigs that I reviewed between Enid and Arlena or Arlena. Which one is your favorite? I'm about to rename Arlena or Arlena Selena because I feel like I can do whatever I want in this wig. Anything for Selena. Anything for Selena. They were not saying that. Anything for Arlena. <laughs> please let me know your thoughts down below. And if you are new here, definitely check out my $20 Tuesday playlist. I have a slew of wigs in there that are in the $20 price range and below. So if you are new, highly suggest you start with that playlist. And speaking of my new friends, you may as well tap that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. Y'all, putting on these wigs makes me realize that I kind of miss reviewing lace fronts a little bit. I kind of miss it. <laughs> And I see the new drops coming out. I saw what Sensational dropped. I, I see the Outre is dropping stuff back to back. I see them. I've been able to pick up a few things here and there and I have things planned. I know I have been caught up on my headband wig train, but trust and believe your girl has not forgotten about my beautiful synthetic wigs. So you will have more of those coming. To all of my new subscribers, thank you so much. We are getting so close to 20K. So close. The fact that I'm even saying this right now is blowing my mind. Like, what? 20K? 20K? Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> if we reach that mark in October, I just might cry. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna cry on camera, but I might shed a little thug tear because y'all have been rocking so hard with me. And also, C wanted me to tell y'all a huge thank you because she felt a lot of love on her birthday. Libra Gang Gang 1015. So thank you so much for showing us love on the videos that we've done together. I'll link those in the description box as well. And of course, if you want to see my latest videos, check them out over here to the right of me. Thank you all so much for watching your girl and tuning in for $20 Tuesday. I will see you the next time. Bye.